Okay, hi guys. So I'm gonna be teaching you how to use um, your native instrument expansions in GarageBand for iOS. And I use the iPad to produce mobily, but this works for iPhone as well. Okay, so if you have um, a Mac, it's as simple as just airdropping, but this is for people who may have um, a HP or just not um, a MacBook or a Mac desktop. That's why I'm going about these steps, okay? So first off, you want to make sure you download Native Access. Native Access is free. And if you make an account with Native Instruments, you have access to download this, okay? And so when you buy your expansion, it's gonna to go to your Native Access account, okay? So, the first thing to do with your expansion is you want to click it and see where the installation path is. And mine is user shared. Okay, London Grid Library. So I'm gonna to go to my finder and I'm gonna to go to where I have it saved at. Okay. And here is user shared. Okay, and I have I already have my open. So I'm gonna look for London Grid, because that's the one we're going to be bouncing to our iPad. And these sounds are just real drum sounds, rather than a lot of sounds out there. I don't suggest any other drum sounds than Native Instruments. I can vouch for them. Their sounds are so professional. Maybe all of your favorite songs use um, Native um, Instrument sounds, okay? So... I'm just saying that because I've brought a lot of sounds and they were fake and I'm like, wow, well, I spent $40, but this, this is the real deal. Okay. So if you're a real producer, you want to want real sounding music, please, please get native um, instruments, sounds, I'm telling you. Okay. So then we're going to find our drum expansion. I have like all the expansions, but Here's the one we're going to be using, and then I'm going to drop the arrow, and it's going to just get very meticulous about what I'm looking for. So I'm looking for samples, so I'm going to open up samples, and then here's the drum sounds. It says drums, okay? So I'm going to just uncollapse that. I'm going to click on drums, and the first thing I have to do is make it into a zip file. Now, when you make it into a zip file, it's not going to affect the internal software, okay? So I'm gonna push compress drums and it's compressing it. And then there we are. And as you can see, I have the compressed zip, zip underneath. I'm just gonna go and close that out. All right, so I'm gonna go here. And then I'm going to email this to myself, okay? So I'm going to drag it in here drums and of course the drums are the snares the hi-hats all that other stuff is all in there all right so i'm gonna do that and it's going to automatically send it to my google drive so i hope you have google drive set up on your ipad or on your iphone very simple okay and it's easier to find that way when it sends to google drive you don't even have to like send off this email because it's going to automatically just go straight to your Google Drive. But you can email it to yourself and just save the, the file attachment to your files and do it that way. Okay, so it's saved, so I'm just going to send it to myself. send it off and it's sent and I got one for me okay so now we are in our email okay that we sent to ourselves and you can go directly to Google Drive because they usually just get sent to Google Drive because the files are large but I'm gonna just go to the email and go through it through here I'm gonna click on London Grit and I'm gonna click on these three dots and then I'm going to go to open in and it's going to prepare to export it, which takes a little time. DistroKid, 
They are the reason I was able to purchase my lovely iPad and to teach you what I'm teaching you today. What is DistroKid? DistroKid is a service that music artists use to put their music into online stores and streaming services, and they're able to receive 100% of the revenue from the streaming. Now, with splits, you can set up payments to automatically go to anyone you collaborate with. That's your manager, producer, or even your bandmate, okay? And it's simple. DistroKid will route them the money and the percentage that you put in for them, and all they need is an email, and it's free for the creator. And to set this up is super easy. All you have to do is go to Splits. You put your collaborator's email into the collaborator section, add what percentage you want to share, and DistroKid will distribute their funds to them directly to make sure they are given their just due, and they'll be a part of the entire process. It works out for everyone. Please take advantage of this awesome way to distribute your music independently, okay? You can get 7% off your first year if you use my code, which is in the description box below, all right? I am only a part of DistroKid because I watched another creator's video and I used their discount code, so, you know? So it's awesome, and let's get back to the video. Okay, so now our library has exported fully and now we're going to go to saved files and then it's already named so you don't have to rename it and i'm going to save to icloud drive by pressing save okay so then we're going to go to our files app which is here and then you can see the london grid zip now here you want to touch on this cloud and then it's gonna download everything. So it's five items, but it's a lot of items. So I'm gonna to go to click it. And then I am gonna to go to samples. You see, first of all, the libraries, it's like everything within it, everything. <laughs> so I'm gonna to go to samples. And then it goes by drums, loops, one shots, instruments to you are having access to all of these sounds and sound options. So I'm gonna to go to drums and you can see over here it says nine items. Click that and then you can see how many kicks. We got 97 kicks, snares. Okay, we got 69 snares. So we got a lot of sounds here, okay? So then I'm gonna to go to GarageBand Okay, and we're going to open up a new project by pressing this microphone. Okay, and then we're going to go to loop. Okay, loops, excuse me. And then you go to files. And then you go to browse items from the files app. Okay, and then you want to go to browse again, iCloud Drive. Make sure you go to iCloud Drive. And then you can go to London Grid Library. If you don't see it, you can always type it up here. And boom. So London Grid Library. And then we're going to go to Samples. And then we're going to go to Drums. You go to Drums. And then you can go to Kicks or Snares. So I need a kick, a snare, and a hi-hat just to show you guys. So I'm going to uh, just the first one, I guess. So we are Kick Bodies DS. And then we can go back again, Browse Files app, um, go to Snares. Like that. And then I'm gonna get a hi-hat. So I'm gonna go out of drums, and I'm gonna go to hi-hats, and let me close hi hat. I'm get the DS. So then you just drag and drop it in. I'll show you an example. Kick body's DS. All right, and the way you drag it in is you hold it down, drag it to the left. Pretty much it. Thank you for watching.